Hi everybody, good morning, win today, win tomorrow, and win forever. Win in whatsoever that has to do with you. Welcome back to the channel. I am your girl, Jora Mimi, and God bless you as you stay tuned. On today's video, we'll be talking about how people are now reacting to the baseless allegations against the saint of God, Saint Prophet T.B. Joshua. Guys, do you know something? That nowadays, many people don't believe anything about the allegations against the saint of God. Let me give you something. A lot of South Africans who believed that whatsoever the people who came out to speak against the saint of God and prophet to be Joshua said were truth, they are now like, no, to be Joshua has really been a true servant of God. Many of them were saying that, uh, I posted a video, one came to say, why not me to say so many people are now saying that those people that spoke against the saints of god saints prophet tb joshua were just looking for attention they wanted attention but since they know that prophet tb joshua is an icon in the whole world they decided to use him to, to use his name to bring in their propaganda in order to be identified in the society guys do you know that a lot of south africans they are not saying oh those south africans that spoke against prophet Joshua, they have been capable of speaking against men of god just the way they spoke against prophet tb joshua remember there's no let us speak uh, one did not only speak about prophet tb joshua you know i don't want to start calling names but one spoke about prophet tb joshua how prophet tb joshua slept with her and also pastor chris oyakilome and the question that troubles many minds now is my dear sister you said prophet tb joshua slept with you and after some time he said pastor chris also slept with you they don't believe this thing they call christianity and the rest the question now is many are asking what do you want are you an evil spirit or the devil moving around looking for who to devour i don't understand so you're moving around looking for servant of god to sleep with or what is happening with you and some were even asking why are you not married why are you always getting victims of being uh, molested sexually by servants of god is there not something you need to tell the world oh but people who throw stones at me when i said the allegation were all baseless are not saying that oh mimi what you first of all said was just so true a lot of them they are unable to even voice out anything now because they are now repeating what they saw. I beg you all, you should come out and speak. They say there is no sin that is unpardonable. No sin is unpardonable. God Himself will forgive you. I mean, pray for God to forgive you. Yes, when God forgives you, the people you hurt from the baseless allegation, the people you make them, you, you brought down their faith, God is going to make their faith to be lifted. I just let me share this with you. Thank you for watching. See you in our subscribe video. Bye bye. Please, can you turn on your notification bell so that each time I upload a video, you're going to get notified. Thank you. Bye bye.